To watch this video in Hindi, go to the settings and select Hindi audio. Namaskar and welcome to Simplify Your Space. In today's video, we will explore some money-saving tips that involve recycling and repurposing. These ideas can help cut down on the need for new purchases, ultimately saving you money while using household resources more efficiently and reducing waste. Let's get started. These 5 or 10 kgs bags of flour and rice are usually made of good quality thick plastic. Once we empty them, many of us simply throw them away. However, there is a smart way to repurpose them. Cut open the empty packet along three sides to create an open sheet. If it is a flour packet, wipe it with the wet cloth to remove any stuck flour. Now you can use this sheet as a liner to protect kitchen drawers or cabinets. The smaller 5 kg packets can be handy in various ways. For instance, you can place it under the chakla while making rotis to keep the kitchen counter clean. You can even create a larger surface by combining two small bags. For example, I tape together two sheets to make a big one which I keep in my kitchen drawer. Whenever I need to do repotting of plants or plants maintenance, I spread this sheet on the counter and place the plants on it, making it easy to work comfortably. Because the sheet is plastic, it is waterproof, so any mud or water that spills during the plant care is contained, keeping the counter clean. These simple tricks make daily life easier and help with household chores. Let's talk about another tip. In Indian cooking, we use lots of different spices every day and they can be pricey. Lately, there has been concern about the purity of store-bought spices. While making all spices at home might not be realistic for everyone due to time constraints, but it's worth trying out a few simple ones. You can easily make coriander powder, red chilli powder, cumin, black pepper and mint powder at home. Just toast the whole spices lightly and grind them up for fresher, tastier results. Trust me, the homemade ones taste better than store-bought. When you use these fresh spices in your cooking, you will notice a real difference in flavor. For mint powder, all you need to do is wash fresh mint, dry it in the sun and grind it. It is perfect for adding a burst of flavor to dishes like raita or paratha. Same way, to clean our houses, we often rely on expensive commercial cleaners. However, you can make effective cleaners at home using ingredients that are readily available at home. Today, we will make two cleaners which I personally use every day. For the first cleaner, mix equal parts water and vinegar and add 2 to 3 spoons of dishwashing liquid. Mix it well. For the second cleaner, fill a spray bottle with water and add 2 to 3 spoons of dishwashing liquid. Mix it thoroughly. Label or mark each bottle accordingly. For instance, label 1 and 2. The water and dishwashing liquid cleaner is great for cleaning kitchen countertops, stove tops, chimneys and can even be used for dusting and cleaning tables. The vinegar based cleaner is effective for cleaning appliances like fridge, washing machine and microwave. 
Vinegar also adds a shine to stainless steel surfaces. This cleaner is particularly useful for removing soap scum from glass bathroom partitions. It is highly recommended for regular bathroom cleaning and mirror polishing. Now let's see another helpful cleaner. After using lemons at home, I don't throw away their peels. Instead, I collect them in a box and store them in the freezer. When it is time to clean kitchen appliances like an electric kettle, I take out a few lemon peels. For cleaning the kettle, I simply add water and 3-4 lemon peels, then boil it 3-4 to four times. This effectively cleans the kettle. Similarly, to clean the microwave, I place water and lemon peels in a microwave safe bowl or cup and heat it for 2 to 3 minutes. The steam from the boiling water helps loosen dirt and grime making it easy to wipe clean with the cloth. After using the lemon peels for cleaning, I don't discard them. Instead, I add 2 spoons of baking soda to the water and lemon mixture and pour it down the sink drain. This helps clean the drainage pipe and remove any clogs. Additionally, I rub the lemon peels all over the sink surface and let them sit for 5 minutes before rinsing. This leaves the sink sparkling clean. Lemon peels can also be used to remove hard water stains on taps. By repurposing lemon peels that would otherwise be thrown away, I efficiently clean my kitchen and that saves money on expensive cleaners. To collect household waste, many of us use expensive garbage bags. But did you know you can make these bags at home using just newspapers and a glue stick? It's easy and quick. You might have seen street vendors using similar bags. Here is how to make them. Take a newspaper and fold it to your desired size. Then use a glue stick to secure the edges. You can make bags in various sizes, large, medium and small. Use the large bags to cover the garbage bin for dry waste. I won't recommend these paper bags for wet garbage. Keep the smaller ones in your kitchen. They are handy for collecting vegetables and fruit peels while cooking, keeping your kitchen counter clean. After use, you can dispose of them right away or reuse them if they are not too dirty. You can also keep small bags in your bathroom cabinet for disposing of hygiene products. It is a simple and useful way to repurpose newspaper and save money on buying garbage bags. After brewing coffee at home, we often discard the leftover coffee grounds as waste. However, there is a better way to use them. I store the coffee grounds in a container after sun drying them. 
Every 15 to 20 days, I make a solution of water and waste coffee grounds and let it sit overnight. This turns it into a great fertilizer that we can use for our plants. Additionally, the dry coffee grounds can be used to create an excellent face scrub and mask. I personally use it regularly. Simply take some coffee grounds in a small bowl, add honey and rose water and mix well to make a paste. Apply this on your face and leave it for 10 minutes. Your face will become soft and glow afterwards. As you can see, we found many useful ways to repurpose household waste. By utilizing these resources wisely, we not only contribute to a better environment and sustainable living, but also save money. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to like and share it. See you next week. And until then, happy organizing from Simplify Your Space. Bye-bye.